Yo, what up guys? Welcome back to a new video. It's your boy Ryan's here and today I'll be optimizing my laptop. It's an Acer Nitro 5 from Acer. So, hope you guys enjoy. Please like and subscribe if you're not already. And I'm out. Peace, bro. Peace. So now I am in Fortnite and we get about 200, 250 FPS, 130 FPS stable as you can see. Please stay until the end. So now let's uh, jump right into Fortnite. But please excuse my uh, trouble with the internet. I don't know what's happening exactly, but you can see it's not going very well by now. So, okay, now let's jump into Fortnite. So now I'm in Fortnite and as you can see I am having like 220 FPS stable at least 200 FPS sometimes 220 but from 200 it doesn't load so down so um I haven't even warmed up so please excuse me but yeah so this is just a uh, FPS test um after I optimize my laptop so this is how it shall go my settings are uh everything is an epic and yeah i accept textures i i think i can get uh higher fps if i lower those things down but it will not be like maybe 10 or 20 fps uh more it's not too much but yeah you can you can actually uh tell the difference later so yeah now let's go uh with the tweaks okay so first of all we're going to start with my optimization pack uh link will be in the description so you will be downloading uh first mem reduct uh this will help to uh reduce your uh your uh ram memory um uh, usage and you're gonna open it and you're gonna copy these settings you're gonna go to memory cleaning and check all of this as you can see you have a usage of 94 percent available uh 7.73 megabytes i have eight gigabytes of ram as and as you can see seven um, megabytes is like quite high enough like to make my ram like suffer you know so we're gonna put clean memory and that will clean a lot of our memory i think so you put okay and yes yeah, so as you can see now we have usage of four percent and does help a lot while playing as you can see and yeah then what we will do is open msi after burner you click yes and in here i like to keep it i like to keep it um 158 on the core clock and on a memory clock it will be like 500 or 700 sometimes in my case i'm going to change it to 700 because i think it's better you click save this uh buttons will start like uh, flashing but it's just to save like the preset you know each number this one is not uh, take it so you can click on any um, unhighlighted uh, number and it will save us a preset now this button what we'll make is that it will start as you can see apply at windows startup so this setting will apply when you start windows so be sure you have this checked and that will be all for msi afterburner then what you're going to open is quick cpu this will help uh, a lot with your uh, core and uh, RAM usage too. So be sure to copy all of my settings. As you can see, you have to set a power plan and make sure it's on that power plan. So I'm going to put it on ultimate performance. For me, it's way better. So you can try with any one of these. And, and the difference between the ultimate performance and the high performance is that if you are if you have uh, lower uh, lower end PCs, it will affect like ultimate performance on the power uh, supply of your PC or laptop. So, yeah, in in this case, you will put high performance, or you can try out on ultimate performance. And if it doesn't crash or anything, or it doesn't doesn't bring you any problem, you can 
maintain it in that. So core parking, who's going to start down here and be sure, make sure everything is on 100% in performance to 100% click apply and that will be all for uh quick cpu settings and yes so now we are back on my um laptop optimization pack and first of all you're gonna click on laptop fps pack now you're gonna open it and here you're going to have everything you can read this first now uh what this says is to make a re restore point. So if you click here and put a restore point here, you can uh, create a restore point. So if anything goes wrong with your PC, you can go back to where you left to a certain time. Uh, so I think I did explain that correctly. So, okay. You create that restore point and that will be good for you. Now, First of all, we're going to use Razer Cortex. This is a very important app to uh, really boost up FPS and clean your PC. I already have it installed and I'm going to open. You you are going to download this pack and you're going to install Razer Cortex on your PC or laptop. And, and then you will open it and it will be like in the app. I'm going to show you right now. So now that you are in Razer Cortex, the first thing you're going to do is to go to System Buster. Then when you get to System Buster, you're going to scan. It's like CC Cleaner or those uh, apps that clean your PC files and delete everything you don't need. So Razer Cortex has this uh, option. It will clean anything you don't need on your PC. As you can see, this found 9, 291 megabytes of uh, unused uh, space or trash space as you can see that's consuming my uh, computer resources and making my disk uh, get uh, fuller so you click you click clean and it will automatically uh, clean everything for you and then you press done and it will be all ready then you go to speed up and then everything this is a list of everything that will be optimized in uh, when you put optimize. Your system has been optimized. And yeah, that's everything you had to do in System Booster Speed Up. And then you can also defrag games, but I don't have uh, the option to do that because uh, you can't defrag games when you have those games installed in the same SSD you have your games. So, okay. Then we go to Game Booster. So here is where you will be optimizing the game. I mean, um, certain things System Booster didn't do uh, that uh, really affect your game. This Game Booster is going to optimize just for you. You click Boost now and it will start releasing memory. It will help like your RAM as the other app did. But you know, with uh, you can see <laughs> it released 121 gigabytes of RAM. 1 gigabyte, 21 megabytes of RAM. Now we are back on uh, my laptop FPS pack and we can go now to Fortnite tweaks, high performance Fortnite, high power Fortnite, I mean. And you click yes and okay. This will optimize uh, how the energy is used on your PC. Then you go to optimizations and the, here you can. Um, do all of these uh, optimizations like better response time yes okay this will disable things you don't need when you're playing and are making your computer go like slower and wouldn't give um, or, and are like things that will, will let your PC get to the, to the better place like the highest level of performance it can have so yes this will help a lot so you can put yes okay to everything and yeah that will be all so now we're on the on the menu of my fps pack and this will be the last one the extra important tweaks now these were already on the other uh on this one but uh these ones are the most important for lower end pcs this will help you to uh make windows like go way smoother trust me and yeah, it will help a lot with your with your PC.